Nobody knows for certain what awaits us in Andromeda. Though our long-range scans have provided a map, there are no guarantees on a voyage that will take us 2.5 million light-years away from home. That's where the Pathfinder team comes in. My name is Cora Harper, second in command on the human Pathfinder team. It's our job to find and secure potential golden worlds, identify settlement sites, and start the process of building our new home. We act under our own authority and represent the tip of the spear in Andromeda. Every arc has its own team, and every team has its own Pathfinder. Senior mission officers, experts in survival, diplomacy, and if that fails, combat. Our Pathfinder on Arc Hyperion is Alec Ryder, whose pioneering service history speaks for itself. A skilled soldier with N7 ranking and a talented scientist, Ryder was a member of the original task force who traveled through the Charon Mass Relay and took humanity's first steps across the galaxy. Now, he's preparing us to tackle the next great frontier, Andromeda. Liam specializes in crisis response. Every team needs its idealist, and Liam is ours. Sarah and Scott Ryder are Pathfinder's son and daughter and former Alliance recruits fresh off tours with the Arctura Station Outpost and Prothean Artifacts team, respectively. And myself, Lieutenant Cora Harper. To be brief, I'm a biotic, the team's operations specialist in charge of ground missions, and I spent the last four years serving alongside Asari Commandos. And finally, our last team member, Sam. Short for Simulated Adaptive Matrix, Sam is an artificial intelligence designed by our Pathfinder himself. From his node in the Ark, Sam receives a direct feed of the Pathfinder's sensory input via a neural implant. It sees and feels as Ryder does, providing him advanced situational awareness, problem solving, and even tactical enhancements. All members of the Pathfinder team receive implants, allowing them to communicate directly with Sam. The individuals who make up this team are everything the Andromeda Initiative represents. A chance for the bravest and the brightest to come together for something bigger than ourselves. If you have what it takes to join us, we'll make sure there's a bunk on the Tempest with your name on it. Is that our golden world? That's Habitat 7. New Earth, if we're lucky. We're marooned. 20,000 souls adrift at sea. When the power runs out, stays out, we need to know if that's safe harbor. Shuttle 2, taking your lead. Good luck, Pathfinder team. All stop, now! Get us out of here. They've got us pinned against the skirt. I am Arkham. Surrender or burn. Please, you're not really going out there on your own. We're explorers. Not an army? Sure, we've been outplayed. The Archon is a master of his game. We're about to change the rules. A human from another galaxy. A Pathfinder. <laughs> I don't need an army. I've got a Krogan. Go right, it'll be fun. This is exactly why we came. Cover's blown, run! They want to fight? We'll give it to them! We're breaking! Keep it up! Been waiting 600 years for this. We slept for hundreds of years, dreaming of a new home. But when we finally awoke, 
Our dreams of peace were shattered. Welcome back. You're the new Pathfinder. This is incredible. It's acting like a gravity well. I have a bad feeling. We're the aliens. My God. Sam related the tests that were stranded but alive. No choice but to investigate the signal. Pathfinder, this console controlled gate. Mass Effect Andromeda is the next generation of action RPG. Yeah, no way this is home. Brand new epic sci-fi adventures set in a vast explorer galaxy. You are the Pathfinder, part explorer, part soldier, part guide. And it's your mission to find a new home for humanity. But in Andromeda, resources are scarce, worlds are hazardous or outright uninhabitable. Every planet has its own story. On this one, warring out of factions fight over every available scrap. You can make new allies or enemies. The choice is yours. Not too shabby for folk who got kicked off the station with nothing to show for it. All I see is the trail of bodies they left behind. Sam, tell me about Sloan Kelly. Before joining the initiative as the Nexus Security, Miss Kelly served the Alliance in the near spotless record. Nearly? She was involved in multiple altercations with other officers. A hothead. Great. What bring the Pathfinder to a humble port? Van Terev. Name ringy bells. What's he to you? And don't lie to me. Just point me to where you're holding them and there won't be any trouble. There won't be. Drop it! Now! You first! Get out, or I'll put you down. These worlds are big, so for the sake of time, we're gonna speed up our adventure. There are many paths to follow on this planet, 
you'll need everything at your disposal to survive. Whether it's a six-wheel drive nomad, which protects you from hazards and enemies, or the scanning analysis tools to help interpret everything you discover. Look for anything that might lead us to the killer. The tracks make it look like an ambush. Face the Rokar profile. It's a start. And Garn blood. Matches your Rokar theory, Reyes. Keep scanning. We need hard evidence. In dangerous alien galaxy desperate for resources, conflict is inevitable. But you'll have access to futuristic weapons, gear, and powers to help you in your fight for a new home. Start out with the ship and the nomad. Almost everything else you need, you'll have to find, steal, or craft yourself. And that's critical to your survival. These worlds have many dangers, from environmental hazards to hostile wildlife. Hi everyone, I'm Aaron Flynn, General Manager here at BioWare. I'm excited to show you a glimpse of how Mass Effect Andromeda is taking the power of Frostbite new heights on the Sony PlayStation Neo platform. Before we get started, if you're not watching this in a 4K screen, find one and come back. Our game is going to look fantastic on whatever platform you choose to play on, but this video is meant to be experienced in 4K. 4K allows the game to take on new levels of depth, making Mass Effect more immersive than ever. No sunlight, no water. They should all be dead. What you're seeing here is a very small slice of the game in development. Everything here is in game, captured directly from a PlayStation EO during pre-alpha. We selected this segment specifically to showcase some of the ways that Neo will bring our environments and characters to life like never before. Our remnant. Remember, they don't turn nasty unless you get too close. Beyond higher resolutions, we will offer high dynamic range lighting on supported platforms. That means every detail will come to life with a sense of depth, richness, and realism that simply hasn't been possible in the past. Will you look at that? Wow, I really was just scratching the surface. Feel that? This whole platform's resonating. Something. We leave you now with a cutscene where you can really see our characters up close. Be sure to tune in on November 7th when we'll premiere a brand new trailer and officially open doors to the next chapter of the Mass Effect universe.
Is that the Helios Cluster? Yeah. There we are. All these points will be vaults in other worlds. Dormant like this one. Hey, look there. The whole place is lighting up. How our readings are off the chart. Really off the chart. But if it's back online, we should be good. resource and guide for the duration of this briefing. Inspired by the Milky Way Citadel, the Nexus is a solar streamlined space station designed to serve as your central support hub and temporary home once in Andromeda. The Nexus carry with it a contingent of officials, engineers, traders, and security personnel on its voyage to Andromeda. All remaining humans will travel together, 20,000 strong, on a Hyperion. Even with faster than light travel, it would still take several human lifetimes to cover the 2.5 million light years to your destination. Survival will be made possible by spending the majority of this voyage in cryostasis, protected beneath the massive shields generated by your pods. As you travel to the edges of the No Galaxy, a small escort of combat pilots will defend us from any threats. However, once we cross in dark space, we will be alone with only our kinetic barriers to shield us during our centuries-long journey. Once in Andromeda, the Nexus and Arcs will rendezvous in the Helios Cluster, and operations will commence immediately. While the Nexus will be largely functional at launch, many elements of its construction are only scheduled for completion upon arrival at our destination. Docked to Nexus, the Arcs will provide additional power and store to the station. You will be revived and assigned quarters in one of the residential blocks for a short time as our immigration staff assists you in choosing a new homeworld. Until the Pathfinders completed securing his habitats, Nexus will offer many duties and distractions. The archives in the Cultural Center has the combined history of the many Milky Way species and will assist new races encountered in learning about our galaxy and its past. Lush hydroponics gardens are available for a quiet escape. Or you can also take the opportunity to socialize with a visit to the Vortex Lounge for any desired off-duty indulgences. The Operations Center will oversee security and management of the entire station, housing everything from colonization efforts to Pathfinder HQ, where Pathfinders will converge to share information and discuss the progress. The state-of-the-art science labs will also be on hand to investigate their discoveries as they begin to unlock the secrets of this new galaxy. Together, you will create a buzzing center of trade, community, government, and diplomacy. Beating hard at your new beginning in Andromeda. I am we slept for hundreds of years. <laughs> Dreaming of a new home. But when we finally awoke, our dreams of peace were shattered. Pathfinder. This is incredible. It's acting like a gravity well. I have a bad feeling. We're the aliens. God.
Congratulations on your successful acceptance into the Andromeda Initiative. My name is Gian Garden, the founder of this unprecedented mission. This journey is a major milestone for all of humanity, as well as every other species in Milky Way Galaxy. You are about to embark on a voyage unlike anything attempted before. And make no mistake, this is a one-way trip. 600 years from now, you will awake from cryostasis on the outskirts of the Andromeda Galaxy. Most of you will be aboard Ark Hyperion, while the rest will travel on the Nexus with me. In addition to Hyperion, three other Arcs, each harboring a separate species, will depart the Milky Way at the same time. Each Ark will be assigned its own Pathfinder, a blend of elite soldier, scientist, and guide who will be tasked with finding a new home on one of the golden worlds that our long-range sensors have identified within Andromeda's Helios cluster. Over the coming months, you will be briefed on a selection of classified information, all of which will be critical to your success. ARC's Nexus Overviews Ground and Space Vehicle Certification Outpost Establishment Guidelines First contact protocols should we encounter new sapient life forms. In addition, those accepted onto Pathfinder team will also receive weapons, biotics, and survival training for even the harshest environments. You represent some of the best humanity has to offer, and I again salute your bravery in accepting this mission. There are no guarantees, no certainties. But, if successful, we have a chance to do the impossible and create a new future for all humanity. Begin your journey. This path began a long time ago. A course paved through human history that took us across continents, oceans, and ultimately, to the stars. For us, this planet is home. It's protected us, challenged us, and provided us the foundation to become galactic citizens. But the time has come to prepare ourselves for a future beyond the Milky Way. A future that begins 600 years from where we stand, in a time and place among unknown stars and unseen dangers. And so we issue this call to the brave, the inquisitive, to the trailblazers of the human race, as an invitation to stand on the shoulders of those who came before, challenge yourself to go further. Begin. Our survival as a species has always depended on our drive to seek out the undiscovered. Push beyond our limits and expand the boundaries of our known world. With Mad Effect, we are going further than ever before. To Andromeda. To build a new home for humanity. Imagine since star systems with remote hostile planets. Teeming with alien life and civilizations. Worlds where adventure, danger, and the unknown are waiting to be discovered. We've created a universe that you lose yourself in. A whole new galaxy for you to explore. We are travelers. 
constantly moving forward and looking back. Alone and as one. We have no choice but to try for our insatiable curiosity. For our fear of what would happen if we don't. You are that explorer now. We will say goodbye. And you will look back one last time. And know that wherever you go, we will be with you. This is Commander Shepard, signing off. An old cowboy went riding out one dark and windy day. On a ridge he rested as he went along his way When all that wants